Hello, how are you? Hi, good. Um, I would like to get the um, Fiesta taco salad. I think that's what it's called. Um, yes, ma'am. Yeah, I'd like to get that and a large... Um, do you have Coke or Pepsi here? Pepsi product. Um, I'd like to get that and a large Pepsi. And um, also I would like to get um, a large Reaper's fries, if you still have that. A, la a large who? Um, the, a large Reaper's fries, if you still have that. We only have one size in it. You want the regular size? Yeah, yeah. The regular. Um, and also two Chalupas, Chalupa Supreme, two Chalupa Supremes, and, um, a large Skittles Strawberry Freeze, and that is it. Oh my gosh, she literally just said shit. She literally just said shit. Yes, hot sauce, please. Thank you. Alright, guys. So, I just got my food from Taco Bell. And... <laughs> Look at how gigantic this bag is. Like... This is huge. And... It was so warm, it got steam all over my car seat. I got a lot of really good food here. Um, I got the Reaper's fries, two chalupas for myself, and I got this Skittles freeze. My mom got the taco, the fiesta salad, and my mom also got this Pepsi. Well, I got the pe I got this food for my mom and I, and I'm drinking some of her Pepsi, so shh, don't tell her, okay? Mm. I'm only taking a little, just a few sips. That's enough. <laughs> but I just, I love soda so much. I'm like this. Okay, so I'm going to go back to my house and film myself eating all of this stuff because it's really dark in my car and I think it'll actually be brighter in my house <laughs> now that I have a light bulb and all. So see you there. Hey guys. So I'm finally back home. It didn't take me that much time to drive back home, but I'm back home now and I've been sipping on quite a bit of my strawberry Skittles freeze here. It's really um, yummy. I love I love the strawberry Skittle freeze at Taco Bell. I always get it. Unless I'm getting Pepsi. <laughs> I usually get the Skittles freeze. And, okay, so look at how these. Ah! Oh my gosh. Look at how they put the Reaper's Rise in the package. Like, they barely. They didn't even really close it. So I almost spilled out all of my fries. And look at how much sauce is spilling out on the side. See, like, that looks really messy. But like, I mean, this is what it looks like. Don't want to spill this on my laptop, but hopefully you can see that pretty well. 
I mean, it's got steak and a bunch of cheese, tomatoes, and it looks like it already ah! has hot sauce on it. Just got some pieces of cheese all over my bed. Great. Don't mind me. Mmm. <laughs> the sauce is pretty good. Mmm. There was a bunch of cheese stuck on the side of this plastic. Okay. So. I can already tell it's going to be pretty good and I'm just going to eat it with my fingers. Let's get a piece, let's get this fry with, because it's right in the middle of the sauce. And let's get a piece of steak and a tomato as well in my mouth. Mm. I mean, this is good, but it's not like how it's not as good as Chelsea Lynn was making it out to be. She's a YouTuber. She was eating these fries and she was like. <coughs> Just like, oh. <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> Get it? That's what she said. <laughs> um, they're good, but I mean, I'd recommend them. It kind of needs more sauce like more evenly distributed though. They kind of didn't really mix it. They just put it on top. I guess I wish they kind of put the sauce more evenly because there's not really a lot of sauce on this side. So if you're gonna put it on top, like put it evenly, evenly on top. I mean, I like it. But, I get why it's called Reaper. It's, um, fairly spicy. I mean, it's not as hot as Sriracha. But it's pretty hot. Oh. Whew. I mean, I can handle spicy food somewhat. But not really. <laughs> I don't know how these mu um I don't even know how to say mukbang. <laughs> I heard how you're supposed to say it, but I keep forgetting how to say it. Mukbang, I think that's how you're supposed to say it. I don't understand how these mukbangers can eat all of this super spicy food. Like I was watching... Zach Choi and Stephanie Sue and they are always eating 
like nuclear noodles, like four times nuclear noodles, five times nuclear noodles, hot Cheetos chicken. That sounds awful. And I love Cheetos, but I would, I've never had a bag of Flaming Hot Cheetos, and I don't think I want to try it. It's probably just, I feel like it might ruin Cheetos for me. And here's the thing, sometimes I crave spicy food. Sometimes I really want really spicy food. I like, I, like, I love sriracha, but I have to be in the mood for sriracha. When, but when I'm in the mood for sriracha, I'm going to need a lot of sriracha. I can handle spice when I'm in the mood for it. But right now, I don't know. Maybe I'm not really in the mood for it. Also, hmm, this, is kind of, this is pretty spicy. I don't know what the sauce is. Maybe they've actually put Carolina Reaper peppers in this stuff. Like just a a cooked down version of it. Maybe. I'm not sure. But I mean this is good. Actually it does have a lot of sauce. It probably does have enough. Yeah, I think it has enough sauce. It's weird. It's like the more I eat it, the more I like it. Hmm. Well, oh, and you know what else? Zach Choi and Stephanie Sue eat. They eat homemade chicken covered in like hot Takis um, crumbs. So it'll be like hot Takis coated chicken. And they'll eat hot Flamings coated chicken as well. But I just don't get how they can stand on eating all that spicy food all the time like that. Like, can you imagine how often they must poop? And how bad their poop probably smells. Because you know when you eat a bunch of pepper and you poop? That poop steams, doesn't it? It smells like pepper. It feels hot coming out. It feels like your ass is on fire. <laughs> and then the toilet smells like fiery peppers. <laughs> your whole bathroom smells like shit and peppers. Shit and hot peppers. You're like, why, did I, why do I do this to myself? And then you remember, it, it tasted really good. That's what's going to happen to me tonight. <laughs> After eating all this spicy food. I need another drink. It's starting to burn a little bit. Don't get me wrong, this is not actually that spicy to me, but it is kind of burning my mouth a bit, you know? It's spicy, but it's not that spicy. I would say that this is about as spicy as, um, sriracha. But... I just like sriracha more. <laughs> it's 
And I wonder what if this sauce is made of sriracha. I look like such a dumbass. <laughs> but um, yeah, this is good. So that concludes my review. One more bite. This is good addictive. I think I I really love this. I can't decide if I love this or the the regular nacho cheese fries at Taco Bell because the regular ones it's like it's nice because you can really taste the cheese since there's no spice but with this there's so much more sauce I feel like I would be in heaven if I could just get this without the spice you know like just nacho steak fries with cheese just the regular cheese with no spice you know I think that would probably be my perfect Taco Bell fries <clears throat> but yeah that concludes my review of the Taco Bell nacho fries I actually ate pretty quickly for once <laughs> okay and uh, I'm back I actually just took a really long break so I didn't even just take a break I stopped eating I ate my all of my reaper fries and then I had to go I had to um, post a video and um, do some editing and um, then I had to go to the store so now it's 1 9 a.m. and I wasn't even hungry anymore so now I'm getting to the chalupas that I got so I got two chalupas and uh, this is what they look like they're so good um, I put a bunch of hot sauce inside of the chalupa and uh, I guess it looks kind of gross but not from where I'm sitting it might look gross on camera but it sure looks pretty good in person and it tastes pretty good. Mm. I'm going to end this book bang here because I ate everything. So, please subscribe to me. Thank you for watching. And bye.